Hello, I'm Mal, and welcome back to Bromance Cute Force with my buddy Sabout. What's up, buddy? Oh, <laughs> it's a Felinus Redacticus. Yay. Yeah, huh. these guys. All right, well, I, I, I mean, I am, I'm, I'm trusting you, buddy. I'm going to trust you. We're staying in this. We're staying in this, as ugly as it is. You feel like you've got a path to victory, so I, I will support your efforts, and, sir. Yes, it's like a new hope here. Are they still in the Opera Max system? They are. They are. Yeah, yeah, just keep popping in, and I'll keep popping in over there, too. Let me know if you see any crazy movement, but I'm going for another planet right now. Okay, okay. Yeah, man, holy crap, though. They got all kinds of pissed off when I went deeper into their territory. Yeah, they didn't Whew. like that. Well, they they completely gun. They went right after you and cut you, to, uh, cut you off. I've never seen an AI um, run me down. AI's never run me down like that before. Which actually was kind of interesting, too, how quickly... I mean, their jump drives are no faster than ours, so yeah. it's kind of... I was like, what's that all about? I'm really hoping if I bombard this planet, our allies will throw troops at it, but it's hard to say. We'll find out. I'm not really sure where, where the Federation's ships ran off to. They were around here a bit ago. So I'm going to redo my ship designs too to switch They're to... They're still sitting on Opera Max. They haven't moved any troops there or anything. And we're back at 9%. Okay. Must be ticking war score then, huh? I think so. I'm going to try not to get in any battles with them so they don't get any more war score to help them. And I'm going to keep taking planets that I can take over here. I'm going to go for, like, matter disintegrators, I think. Actually, do you have any troops, or did you lose them? Uh, I do, but I don't want to send them out unless you're going to escort them, because I've lost a, you know, a buttload just okay. sending them, and they're getting killed on the way. I've got... So if you want to meet them in a system and then escort them, I'll be more than happy to give them. Yeah. I've got a bunch, actually. I'm in Python right now, but I can't move my fleet, but I got a few troops. I don't have a whole lot. I lost uh, all mine. I've only got about six, but that might be enough to take this planet. I don't think this planet's that heavily guarded. Actually, I've got seven that I can send you. I don't see any fleet movement right now from them. Still sitting at 9%. I thought there was a second planet in this system. Here's what I'll do. I'll send them to Eskme, and then... We can take it from there. You can, if you need me to send back up, I'll, I'll send it. Okay. And I'm just going to build like a madman here. I'm going to go ahead and land my armies real quick and I'm going to move to another planet. I'm going to go for their vassals. Because you said they're not, they're not reacting to that, huh? No, they don't seem to be moving their fleets around when I go for their vassals. It's almost like they don't care unless I'm directly attacking them. Oh, and in cool. fact, cool. the Serene Foundation tried to defend their own planets and lost their fleet. So maybe I'll jump up to the Inari next, try to bait their 100k fleet out and destroy it. Got a ton of pops getting out of control. Why? Why do I have so many pops getting out of control? You suppressing them? I am, but I'm gonna run out of influence because there's so many of them. Are they upset because of the war? I'm not sure if that was even a thing, but maybe. See what happens. Oh, I thought I was attempting planet fall. Where's my troops? Oh, did I lose my troops? How the heck did I lose my troops? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like, it's really risky moving them around. Well, I don't even have any troops anymore. I can't even take any planets if I wanted to. I can send some to you if you want to tell me where you want them going. Yeah, I'm in Pythum. 
if you can do like a if you can kind of make sure you go around I'm not really sure they must have sent something to catch my troops I'll I'm gonna build some weaker troops and just try to mass build them because those you know take a long time to build where's this oh I see where Python is okay so I'm gonna try to take the back way to Python but the system itself is clear yeah it's clear and I've got ships on the outside ready to meet your why aren't the Vipecula stars they got a ton of transports there why aren't they landing there's I don't know why they've got a ton of troops here but they're not landing all right well I have gene warriors on their way hopefully they survive I've got troops on the outsides of the systems just in case any stray ships try to come in and be funny And I'm going to fortify, re-fortify Eskimo. I'm losing a lot of influence. Why? Suppress factions and edicts. Well, I guess I could turn the edicts off. I just don't know which ones have. Unless I turned them off already. Well, I don't understand why I have so many factions going crazy. There's no indication at all? Not really. Nothing says, like, this is why. And they just, like, even though they're suppressed, it doesn't seem to be helping all that much. <sighs> so I have to keep an eye on it. Did your troops make it? Yeah. Awesome. Did they? Yep. So you can land on... Oh, wait. Don't land yet. For some reason, my ship stopped bombarding it. All right. Let me know when they're ready. I took like a super roundabout way of getting there. So good. Kept them alive. Oh, here comes our allies at least. About time. Permanent Johnny come lately is those guys. Yeah, they love it. Needless to say, they love it. We're at 9% still. Take the planet, it'll drop a little bit, but I'm going to go for the uh, Ricotta Star Imperium next. And, uh, okay, but don't, don't, don't leave me, though, until I... Yeah, until I'm not going to wait till you're ready. Where, uh, Pithrum or whatever, is that what we're doing? Yep. Dropping now. All right. Hopefully that's enough. Hopefully, I was going to say, hopefully it's enough because this is all I had available. I'm building some more troops right now, but they won't be ready for a little bit. But I'm going to get them. I think, I think they're going to win this. Yeah, there shouldn't. I mean, the tro troops that are on the ground are not that powerful. They just have a lot of them. Exactly. Yeah, it looks like we're good. Uh, yeah, the bombarding is definitely helping. And you've got a pretty good gen uh, general, too. Yep, we're going to take as it. As long as we don't lose any, they'll heal up, so it should be okay. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Awesome. Okay. Didn't do anything for our war score, that's... Well, put us at seven. Interesting. It put us at locked us at seven percent. Now, if I go bombard another planet, it'll probably put us at about fourteen. I'm gonna, uh, whenever you're ready, let me know, and I'm gonna move to the next planet. So far, the. Go ahead. I'll move with you. Where are you going? I mean, um, I'm gonna go to the Rakata. Uh, I'm gonna go to Dojak. To Dojak, which is it's where? the Rakata Star Imperium oh, system. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. I'll meet you there. And I've got troops I'm building too. I'm gonna see if anybody comes in there. 
I don't see... Yeah, they're just sitting on that planet bombarding it. They're not even making their way. In fact, the only people that are making their way this way now is the Rakata Imperium with their little 18k fleet. And we can destroy that. So that'll be a, a battle won for us as well. On top of everything else. And our allies seem to be following me now, so things are starting to turn around a little bit. All right, if you want to send your troops up this way then. Oh, yep, you're right. I, I did. They're already yeah. on the way. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll tell them to land. That put us at 14%. Nice, because we're bombard because we're blockading it. Yep, so we're starting to... Maybe going for the vassals was a good idea. I mean, the... <laughs> The Fleens or Dacicus don't seem to care at all that their vassals are being attacked. Now their fleet is the Rakata's fleet's on the way. Yep, it just met with my fleet there. My little, I placed like a little bait fleet on the outskirt that would lock them in the combat. Oh, they sent their troops too. That probably wasn't too smart. We got them though. Actually, destroying their troops is nice because those are the only troops that were sitting outside that planet there, so... That'll definitely set them back. Okay, I'm entering orbit again. Those are down, I'm dropping them. Okay. dropping awesome all right i got a couple okay troops and i am your fallback position your fallback position is eskme okay if things start turning bad that's where you go All right, that planet's ours. Let's move into Taurus there, which is the other Ricotta Systems planet. Okay, let me pause this for just a second because I need to do this before we move on. Okay. Just got to redesign the fortress so I can update all of these. Just one second, and then we can go after them. Yep. Okay, that's not good. What's up? I'm out of influence. Although they do seem to have somewhat slowed down with their expanding. I'm just curious as to what caused that all of a sudden for you to have like a problem. I don't know. I've got a lot of people, a lot of factions that need to be suppressed. Well, you did also pick up a ton of planets and then you just sort of sectioned them off because you had to. So you really, it's not like you were, you weren't, you weren't micromanaging them. So sometimes the sector AI does stupid stuff too. And you were picking up, they were, they weren't your guys. They were aliens. Yeah. Yep. So I'm sure they were like flipping out on you. Okay. All right. Where are we jumping to? Uh, Tauros, the system above this one. Okay. Go it. ahead and make your jump and I'll follow. Yep, I'm heading that way now. Okay, I'm right behind you. Let me see if the not uh, 
Flynn is so yeah, moving. Yeah, looks like everybody's going with you. That's pretty cool. Okay, so this is working out so far. troops on the move here and they almost got caught I got lucky but we're gonna destroy all of this now the Flinus Redacticus is still just sitting on that planet yeah I don't know why but now they are trying to take back these other planets and we keep fending them off so yeah yeah exactly maybe that's why they keep trying to take back what we've already taken and so they're just sort of stuck in a loop I'm fine with that. Any break we can get at this point, quite honestly. Anything that helps us push forward a little bit. Better than going backwards. We still need a lot of planets, and I think that true should be up for those other ones, but we'll focus on that after this war is done. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. We're at 20%. We're at 20%. So we are only down two. We can force demands, and if we just need three points. Okay, well, we can do that then. Uh oh. Their fleet's on the move now, though, too. We just need this to tick. We just need a little bit of rolling war score here. Oh, I cannot believe their fleet's on the move all of a sudden. It's almost like they know. Actually, half their fleet's on the move. The other half went back to the planet. Where's that half going, though? I don't know. No, they're moving around. They don't know what they want to do. They're confused. They just turned their fleet back around. Now they're going back to the planet to sit on it. It's like the computer doesn't know what to do. It's almost like we've like, by attacking their vassals, it's almost like- Set them back to Bombard. Set them back to Bombard. Are we not bombarding? You weren't. Should be now. There we go. There we go. All right, only one away from acceptance. They're still sitting on the planet. They're kind of shifting around a little bit uncomfortably, but other this than that... This is tense. This is tense! Oh, that's a weird graphical glitch. Oh, boy. Dropping them. All right. I've actually got some armies in the area as well, so I'll help you. I'll land on there and help you break those down a little bit quicker. I like that, like, multiple armies can land on a planet and, like, work together. That's kind of a cool feature when you think about Very it. Very cool. It is super cool. Hey, we did it. That puts us at 18%. So if we go yeah. bomb... If we go blockade something, it should be enough to push us over. Um, Who else is their allies? Or where is their planet? Marfok is oh, the one that's back nope, next right to us. Right here. The Serene Foundation. They have a planet in this system. I'm going for it. Okay. In the Obskike system. Okay, give me a second and I'll grab the troops. In the Obskite system? Yeah. They have uh, the Serene Foundation has one planet there. If I go down and just simply uh, start bombarding it, that should push us over. Okay, hold on, because I'm not with you. I don't even see where you're at. Um, It's down, it's backwards, so back into towards our territory, Obskike. It's right next to the Serene Foundation's planets. I'll just...
O B uh, S O B K S K Y K E. But that's not that's Polynesia's Alliance Sons. That's not. Yeah, but they've they've got a planet in here. The Serene Foundation has a planet in here. Oh, they have a planet. Okay, yeah. I see. I see. And I'm heading. All right, give me a second. Yep. And I will follow you. Okay. <laughs> Unpausing. I just don't want to screw this the, up. Yeah, you know, no, no. I'm laughing because the name of the Polysimus Alliance of Suns. Their the name of their planet's Round Nut. <laughs> well, sure, sure. <laughs> why wouldn't it be? Well, why not? It's a. Yeah. I don't see the problem. It's a I mean, fantastic they, name. I mean, case in point, you know, you wouldn't say square, so you know, <laughs> unless you're having some serious issues. It's. I mean, we don't know. They are aliens. All right, we cleaned well, up. We cleaned up all the stuff that sure. was on there. So, I'm going to start bombarding the planet. That puts us at 25 percent and acceptance. Oh, in demands. Yeah, yes, we yes. did it. High fives. Oh. <laughs> we did it. And that was all you, dude. That's... That was all you. I was. I was saying. I was in between episodes. I was like. I was trying to talk him out of it. I was like, let's just surrender. And Sabas was like, no, don't be a wuss, man. And I was like, oh, <laughs> come on, Sabas. We're beat. We're not beat, man. Stay in it. And I was like, all right, Sabas. I'll trust you. I'll oh, trust you. We got, well, we got super oh. lucky. Oh. But now we know their weakness. Their weakness is we take one the planet. Sabouts Doctrine. <laughs> it's Sabouts, the Sabouts doctrine. doctrine. We take one planet and then we harass their vassals till we force demands. It was awesome. Well, I mean, we not, that was just a test run. We know it works. So let me. I'm gonna. Woo. I'm gonna give you Opera Max. Now, uh, just take a look at Eskime. <laughs> oh, is it? Hold on. It's it's a good fallback point if we have any issues. All right, Opera Max is coming towards you, Eskime. Oh my god! <laughs> well, that's not a bad idea though. And then I got I remembered I needed to change the design because I got a snare on there, and I need to put, I need to put mines. All on right, there, I'm gonna so. take some time. Let's go ahead and take some time to. I need to like get the factions under control and rebuild my fleet. I know you're rebuilding your fleet, and we can use this kind of off time right now to to uh, clean up those small protectorates and get them back as well. Yeah, powerful pop factions, I know. Oh, you know, I've never put mines on here before. Take a look at Eskme. I'm putting them in. I'm redoing it. Kind of cool. It actually shows the minefields. I can't believe how bad these are getting. These pop factions are getting out of control. I still don't know why you're having such a problem with that. Like, I don't know why. I don't know what the causal was for that. It's kind of weird. I don't have very many loyalists, probably some of it. Oh, I sent you Opera Max, by the way. I sent you. Oh, I okay. I didn't see it. Yeah. Got it. Thank you. Perfect. Still think that sounds like a drug company or something. I know, Opera Max. Oh, that gives me a lot of my troops back, too, because I had a ton of uh, troops on that planet. Awesome. We did it. We finally beat the Felinus Redacticus in a war. That was all you, man. That was all you. You had the faith. I did <laughs> not have the faith. Hey, that puts us at 126 out of 141 planets. And if we take we these We just need four, to take these other little bastards back. Yeah, yeah, that'll put us at 130. Which actually, we can declare war on them whenever we want. Yeah, if you want to do it now, I'm, I'm moving into their systems. Actually, currently. Well, let's do let's do a little bit. Let's do. I think you're right. Let's do a little bit of recovery. Let's update our ship designs. Let's uh, let's build some more armies. Let's do the whole bit. And besides, we're up, we're up on time anyway, and we could just continue the next one. Oh yeah, that works. That, is that cool? Yep. Okay, folks. Well, hopefully, you know what? You know what? I'm 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 gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go out on a limb here. I think people should hit the like button. I think you should. I, I normally I'm like, hey, if you feel like it, hit the like button. Just just reach over and be like, eh, click it, 
click click you should and everybody should put a comment on Sabouts's uh video about how badass he is so there should be like a little a little o with a seven is salute i want to see a bunch of salutes for Sabouts because it was his plan i better see it from you people we did it <laughs> All right, so hopefully you did enjoy it. If you did, you know what to do. We need salutes and likes. Salutes and likes for Sabouts. Thanks for watching. Until next time, he is Sabouts, the man with the plan, the doctrine. I am Mal, and we will see you later.